This just popped up. Here's another one. Have they lost their spiritual integrity? Do you trust what you hear? How is their authentic practice of faith lined up with the Word of God? Join us as we quickly examine their trust and credibility on this unexpected pop-up. So please forgive me for not being seen on this pop-up. I've had a busy day and I was preparing for a separate RLE and this literally just popped up. So I said, why not share the experience with my amazing Life Clips family? So sit back and enjoy this pop-up RLE. You don't control the wealth. Listen to me. Force the beast to go into the tribulation broke. Such an offer only a madman would refuse. Force the beast to go into the tribulation broke. Yeah. Force him to go into the tribulation broke. I know it's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> The reason being is because he's given seven years, but only three and a half of that he has any real power. Yeah. Are you crazy? He's got to build up funds. That's because he has to build up funds yeah. to fund that last three and a half years. An imbecile. Don't give him enough to go into seven because no. then he watch, then he would have a completion. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. He's looking to complete a seven year domestic tribulation at no point in your rambling incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought he's he's looking to complete that but if you cut it in half he had cannot it takes him the first half of it to even build up the funds so you have to this is why he wants to get cryptocurrency this is why he wants to get unreal monies flowing everywhere so that he can take the real silver and gold and you have nothing but air snow on your television that's all you end up with in a 15-minute city where you walk down to the 7-eleven and get a heat up barbecue made out of some kind of soy tofu and you go down there and that's all he wants it and they're creating this right now and just because you've got a sparkly swim bicycle then you think you're rich at that point don't worry it's all gonna be over soon it is time to break the beast in a weird way it was almost like i had to sort of fool my mind into believing that it wasn't retarded and you're going to have to stand up and get serious about this thing. What? We must as the body. I'm not talking about just this ministry. I'm talking about the entire body of Christ. You've got to control the wealth of the world. <laughs> You've got to step in and say, hell no. Oh, I've chosen my words carefully. We will not take a fake currency. We we will not take all of this. We will not, we'll not eat barbecue tofu. We're not going to do this. We're going to live in a real world. We are not going to have your fake currency while they build golden idols. Help me help you. You will not live in an unreal world. <laughs> How about new? No. no! Tell the devil no! no. How about new? No. So watching this back is even better with the memes. But anyway, you guys, I want you to listen to this next part. It's golden. Look at that beat you're doing. That is a very prophetic beat. Very, very prophetic. Keep playing with what, what you were playing with. You are an idiot. Is that together? So, so while 
while they're banging the drum to a prophetic beat, because clearly we've heard of that before, you're going to hear uh, Mr. Robin Bullock, I don't know if you even know who this is, um, explain why he uses that word hell. Because uh, when I first heard it, I was like, dang, why is boy cursing? But he'll tell you why he's cursing. He makes an exception to the rule. Come on, hell no! All over the world say hell no! It's weird. The whole thing is weird. Ah, who are you calling? There's a lifeline, Regis. I hope you all enjoy your Saturday. I have no words. Yes. He has said it all for all of us today. Then I ran out. I didn't grab no shoes or nothing, Jesus. Oh.